Well, Tampa Bay's iconic Sunshine Skyway will shut down this weekend as thousands of runners and thrill seekers make history racing in the inaugural Skyway 10K. Traffic anchor Lindsay Logue has the details and detours. It's the tallest bridge in Florida, considered the flag bridge of the state, a popular spot for fishermen, movie scenes, car commercials, <laughs> and now perhaps the start of something new. A road race, 6.2 miles up and over the iconic bridge. Runners have been tossing around the idea for a race over this bridge for years now. Sunday's run will be the first since the bridge was dedicated in 1987. This weekend's run is put on by the Armed Forces Families Foundation. It's taken more than a year to plan, get the permits, promote, and as expected, all 7,000 spots were filled within the first few days of registration. Heads up drivers, northbound lanes on the Skyway shut down at 4 o'clock in the morning. Morning, they don't reopen until 10. I-75 is your only detour. It's estimated to cost the state $5,000 in tolls when the bridge is closed. Money race organizers say they'll pay back. Also, 100% of the proceeds from race registration go directly to the Armed Forces Families Foundation, benefiting local military families. At the Skyway, Lindsay Logue, ABC Action News.